Hello Stamper! Welcome to Frenchie Stamp uh, little video. Here is a card that I had on the blog and many people asked me how I uh, done it. I did the tag a couple weeks ago or last week. I cannot remember when I posted. But today I'm going to show you how to do the background. This was done on well-worn um, DSP. And the one that I'm going to show you tonight is going to be on... Um, uh, spice cake. So first thing you want to do is take your uh, paper and usually I use a scrap paper. This is plenty scrappy for me. I'm going to take my Versamark. You could do it like with the brayer but I like to do it the ink pad right on top of this. So tap your uh, Versamark good on your paper and then we're going to use some heat and stick. I hope I get that right. Here we go. That should be good. As long as you cover it all, good. Now I'm going to take this, put this in my tray, and I'm going to put some uh, heat and stick. What the heat and stick uh, does, it's when you eat it up, it makes a layer of glue. And then when this is done, then we're going to put our glitter on. So let's tap this a bit so I don't have chunk. Let's remove this. Here we go. Now we're going to take our um, heat gun and we're going to warm this up. And you're going to, I don't know how much you can see on the video, when you know it's ready, it's, it's the creamish color, white color, get all like a layer of plastic. And it's, uh, I'm going to warn you, it smells kind of funny using this. It, I, it's not my favorite smell, trust me. Okay, when this is done, then it's very sticky. Like I said, it makes a layer of glue. Then I'm going to take my Dazzling Diamond sprinkle all that all over it and this is going to be Frenchie Strick here I'm going to show you. Okay, many people will call this good. What I do in the next step, I'm going to eat, uh, heat set it again. What I mean by heat set it, it's I'm going to take the gun and go over it and what that does it take the glitter and push it in the glue so that way you know the glitter stick good on it and you just have to do it a little bit you're gonna see some glitter flying that's okay but then it melts the glue again and then your glitter get all the way good in there because a lot of time you don't get it hard enough packing it and then you lose a lot of your glitter well, this way, it's perfect. It eats it right in there. We're going to let it dry because it's kind of sticky a little bit. And uh, yeah, I don't know if you can see, but I got um, that eat and stick flying all over in the glitter too. So you want to make sure you clean your surface when you're done. Okay, with the spice cake, I did so saffron and I passed that in the tulip uh, frame. And this size, it's five and a quarter by four. And this is a regular card, uh, four and a quarter by five and a half. Whoops. Let's try to center this here a little bit. And then I took a piece of the pool party. It, it's not Baja Breeze, it's pool party. I think I said Baja Breeze, it's pool party. I took a piece of that uh, in color pool party ribbon. And then we're going to put that right here, like this. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to put just a little strip of this in the back so it won't move around. This is the snail. Put this here. Okay, let's put plenty of snail back here. I'm going to turn it around to make sure I get it straight though. And this looked pretty good to me. 
here we go now we're going to put this on here I'm going to add more snail right on my ribbon so it's not moving around I don't know how much you can see on the video but it's so so pretty and like for a winter paper winter scene it's gorgeous and then this time the tag that I did this is with the decorative label uh, punch this time I put it on the large oval this one I did a frame and this I get the video how to do this here so you can look on the Frenchie uh, stamp.com look decorative label small and you're gonna find it and I'm gonna use some dimensional if I can grab them I'm gonna put two in the back of this Et voila whoops I'm gonna put that right there and look you get I think you can see the shiny oh yeah so you get the perfect little uh, card and super easy. Till next time, happy stamping!